Good morning and happy Thursday, you guys. I am the... <laughs> what time do you think it is? It's not time. <laughs> These dogs are crazy. Um, but anyway, I woke up this morning and I made my, all, like all the usual stuff. I made my breakfast because we have cheese right now. I made cheesy scrambled eggs and it was delicious. We did run out of tortillas though, so I, ha I couldn't have any more breakfast burritos, but the cheese made it all better. So, and cheese usually does that. I also took care of some laundry and dishes and all that fun stuff. And then I was curious about some of the theme park videos on our, on our vlog. I wanted to see like what percentage of theme park videos are you guys watching as opposed to like just everyday regular videos. And the craziest thing is, is that like, obviously I know you guys probably enjoy the theme park videos more, but it was really crazy to see the difference in the numbers. I'd never actually looked at it. So that was kind of like a, I don't know, like an eye opening kind of thing. Um, obviously I know those, those videos are more popular, but it was just crazy to see the actual numbers. I ha I've never actually gone back and looked at that. Um, but yeah, so I did that and that was kind of time consuming because I went back through like 365 videos. <laughs> I just looked at last year. And the other thing that was kind of cool is that there was so much construction last year. It's really neat to see how excited you guys were about the Harry Potter stuff. And that brings me to the Harry Potter celebration that's happening this weekend. I'm so excited to tell you guys that we will be going tomorrow to see it. So. Um, be sure to check in tomorrow and see that fun video, but I'm very excited about it. Last year I wasn't as into Harry Potter because I didn't really know as much about it, and this year I'm much more excited. I can't wait. I can't wait to see everything. So, and I can't wait to show you guys either. It'll be fun. I really wish we had one of those cameras that had a screen over here so I could see what I was filming because I didn't realize that my hair was sticking up in that last clip. I have these like little baby hairs. I don't know if you guys can see them. Um, they're annoying. They're, they're super annoying because they just stick up and they never grow. So yeah, so that's what happened to me just now, just that last few seconds ago. <laughs> I'm glad these moments are going to be saved on the internet forever. Yay! On that note, we are going to have a live show today, a live mail vlog. So what I'm going to do is get all of this mail over here so that we can, uh, have it with the laptop on the table ready to go so we can have a smooth... Mail vlog. What do you guys think? I hope you guys can come to it. It's today. It's right now. Another thing I'm very excited about in today's vlog is that we will be having ribs. Yay! We've never actually made ribs before. In the 10 years that we've been together, we have never made ribs. So this is going to be a first for us. I've never actually cooked anything like this before ever, but it seems to be fairly easy. So let's give it a try. Look who came home. It's me. It's, it's a me, Tim. Cool, I'm here, I'm here. <laughs> um, so I didn't know exactly how to do this. I waited for Tim to get home and he's gonna do it because he knows more about meat than I do. Yes. This seems weird. Why? I don't know, is this right? Yeah, you said individual ribs, right? Yeah, is that one rib? Yeah. Whoa, these are gonna be good. Yeah, this is a pork rib too. All right. Come on now. So well, I was supposed to get individual ribs, but I guess we don't really sell that here. So we have to cut them and then we're going to put them in this bag with tons of delicious smoky rib flavor and cook them for an hour. And then when we're done with our mail vlog, we'll have ribs and it'll be delicious. I'm glad you're doing this. <laughs> the Hero 3 Plus Silver. So you guys check it out. We are in the middle of a mail vlog. Here's a little bit of behind the scenes. You can see how we have some crazy lighting set up and all of this fun stuff. And then we've got our big pile of boxes over here and all of this fun stuff behind us. We don't have anywhere to sit now. Yeah, and a rolling pin. Yeah, I'm so excited about the rolling pin. <laughs> but say hi, everyone. Hi, everyone. Hi. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching if you watched. We really appreciate it. There we go. I got the camera real fast so you guys can say hi. hi. And butts, apparently. Hi and butts. That's awesome. I hope you guys get to see your names in the vlog. Holy macaroni, guys. It looks like Christmas morning in here. Thank you guys so much for all of this stuff. It is awesome. Wow. This is pretty crazy, right? But you guys are amazing. I wanted to come outside and show you guys. Uh, it's starting to warm up, which is fantastic. It's like 69, 68 degrees outside right now. 
Look at the moon up there. It's crazy looking. Hopefully it's as like crisp for you guys as it is for me. Let me try to zoom in on it really quick. There you go. Oh, sorry, hold on. There it is. Look at how crazy that thing looks. The whole reason that I noticed to look up at the moon is that's it's a reflection in the pool right there. Sorry, it's the, the wind blew all of these leaves into our pool. But yeah, the reflection of the moon right there, it's pretty neat. There it is, look how nice the sky looks tonight too. By the way, this is our final outcome of our wings. Man, they look awesome. And a salad too, to go with it. One of the things that we got was this little mini leg lamp from A Christmas Story. Look, it lights up. Yeah, look at that. I'm gonna leave it on and see how long it, the battery lasts. It's pretty awesome. Look at that, it's over there with our, our shelf -o stuff. Here's the little Mickey toaster that we got, and it like puts little burnt Mickey toasts. See, here's the... Yeah, it's awesome. Oh yeah. no, it makes it so it doesn't cook that section. Well, yeah, but that's how that's how it works. It's pretty awesome. Yeah, I'm excited. I can't wait. Wow. It was like 15 minutes ago that I was out here, like, showing you guys about the weather. Two more rocks for the rock garden. Yes. It, yeah, there you go. Perfect. So I wanted to show you guys the ribs, because I already took a bite out of it, and it was delicious. And then Jen made up some barbecue sauce using yeah. some sticky fingers. And I some... believe somebody sent this to us, right? No, we bought that. <laughs> oh, sorry. Nope. Using some sticky fingers and some mustard. When you add regular yellow mustard to your barbecue, it tastes like delicious. That's something yes. that my dad always used to do, and I love it. Sweet. Yeah, ribs. So you know what the hardest thing about doing a mail vlog is? We filmed the mail vlog for like an hour and a half. And then that like gets me in the mentality like, wow, we filmed a lot today. When all reality, I didn't because I still have to film this one. And I just, I don't know, puts me in a weird mental mood. I had to have Jen film me because I needed both my hands to talk to you guys about this story. And I wanted to tell you the quintessential Florida driver story, right? So, I was on I-4 yesterday. I was going 70 in the 55 mile an hour zone. 70 miles an hour in a 55. I was behind a red truck that had the words Painting Unlimited on the back of them. Like it was their company, Painting Unlimited. And so somebody pulled up behind me in a van and I didn't notice it because I was staying a full car length behind somebody as you should as you're going 70 miles an hour because that's pretty darn fast. And you Well, it's supposed to be one car length per 10 miles an hour. So it should have been seven car lengths. <laughs> right, so <laughs> I was actually following way too close to this guy. But uh, this guy behind me Pulls up behind me, starts tailgating me, and then he pulls over into the far right lane, and as he's going around me, leans his entire body out of the window, so he's driving like this, and he goes like this. He goes, come on, you gotta go faster. You gotta pick it up. And then he pulls from the far right lane all the way over in front of me, behind the other Painting Unlimited truck, because he was also in a Painting Unlimited van, same company, pulled behind him, and then promptly slowed down because everybody in front of them was slowing down. So we slowed down to 55, like everybody else on the highway, because it was traffic. <laughs> and then <laughs> I finally like, right, I'm still behind him, and then he realizes, oh, that's my exit right there. Pulls back over to the right lane, slows down to 45 because he's getting off and he has to be behind somebody else. I pass him and I just look at him like, what? <laughs> and I keep going and then he's way behind me. Still hasn't got off the highway because he got over way too early and he got behind somebody that was going 45 miles an hour. Didn't lean out the window for that guy. But those are Florida drivers for you. It was just, it stuck in my mind because it was such a ridiculous thing that happened on the highway to me. And if you guys come here to visit, be prepared for that to happen to you at least seven times. You know what'll make you feel better? What? Hawaiian chocolate covered macadamia nuts. Yeah, or those burger cookies. <laughs> oh, those cookies are so good. Let's eat all, all of the things. Does it look like I'm going down the stairs? Bye! <laughs> Chandler? Hey, did you find the cameras? Found it. Did you? Yes. It's right there. Right there, okay. found the camera. Yeah. All right, sleeping, of course, on the couch. <sighs> Goodness gracious. Tomorrow, celebration of Harry Potter? Yeah. So, I will see you guys tomorrow. But now it's time to pay the price.